for kids make sure that they're well dressed for the occasion. Miranda. Well, it's December, which means that the Christmas season is officially here and with it, the Holodazzle Open House is happening this Saturday at the Matthews Opera House. Here to give us more details on this holiday fest is Darren Granis. Thank you so much for joining us hey. on Good Morning Coda Territory. Hey, thanks. Thanks for uh, having me on. So holiday fest it's tell me a little bit about this event i haven't heard of it it sounds great uh it, it's basically the 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 chamber of commerce in the city put it on and they ch kind of change the name around a little bit it's uh the holiday of lights it's we do okay. a tree lighting ceremony and then a parade oh, okay. um the matthews opera house is doing its part by having an open house we're going to have santa claus there awesome. polar express movie uh um gift wrapping and things like that. Um, we're going to have uh, some music playing as well. That's going to be from two to four. Great. Then there's going to be other events throughout the town. Then around six is when they do the tree lighting, holodazzle, and then a parade of lights downtown. Oh, I yeah, love that. Main street. Yeah, yeah. I love how the whole community is coming together. And yeah. I like all of the different pieces happening just at the Opera House. That sounds like so much fun. Yeah, and they planned it out really nice, too, because before it was always kind of hit and miss and everybody kind of doing their own thing. Now they've got it literally scheduled out all afternoon, which, it, which is really kind of cool. So. Well, I know I love this time of year, so I yeah, think that yeah. sounds great. Um, but this, I'm sure this isn't the only thing happening at the Opera House. You guys are always busy. What, yeah. what else is happening this holiday season? Oh, man. So literally the day after, Sunday <laughs> at 2, we've got vocal illusionist Lynn Trefsiger, okay. who's going to be at our place. Uh, she does an adult, basically a vocal illusionist show and a family one. We're of course going to do the family version Very cool. of it. And then she's going to be doing a, uh, a workshop over at Creekside Elementary on Monday uh -huh. after that. And then on the 18th, we're going to have Sophia Beatty out again Fantastic. doing her, her big uh, jazz Christmas event she's that great. she always does. Yeah, and that always sells out. So it's best to get tickets. Get tickets now super, while you can. Super <laughs> And, and as an added bonus, we are opening up the box seats for the first time oh. since I've been there. That's yeah, fantastic. Yeah. So, so definitely get on those tickets fast if you right. want. Right. In fact, I think the box seats, we've only got eight of them, and I think we've only got about two left. Okay. So, yeah. Well, yeah. everybody, we're posting the link to it right after this, so you better make sure you get those tickets. <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Really quickly before we run out of time, what's a vocal illusionist? So uh, basically, uh, uh, think uh, uh, ventriloquist. Oh, so okay, think of Je okay. Jeff Dunham. Yeah, I should have explained uh, that. In fact, no, she's done a I lot asked. of a lot of work actually yeah. with Jeff Dunham too. Very so, cool. Yeah, yeah. So it's gonna be it's gonna be really interesting. I think I've so. I've heard from a couple of people in the business that that she's one of the best. So. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think that sounds fun, and everything sounds great. I'm always glad to have you here on the show to tell us a little bit about what's happening up in the Northern Hills. Yeah, I really appreciate being here, so thank you. Yes, thank you so much, Darren. And make sure that you guys stick around. We're going to have some more news for you and another